All right, what's going on? This is Chopper, and yes, you are seeing this correctly. This is Minecraft. This video is going to be very quick. It's basically going to show you how to enable ray tracing on a realm. So as you can see, we're on a realm right now. You can see it's got the, the player list. I'm the only one here. And usually for ray tracing to work on the Bedrock Edition, the world needs to be like essentially created with ray tracing enabled. I don't really understand it exactly but I know you can't just enable it on any random world, which is very dumb. If they're going to add ray tracing to the game, how come you can't just turn it on normally, like with a setting? Look, I'll show you right now. When you go into settings, you can go to video, and where's, where's ray tracing? Oh, here it is, but it's blocked. And it tells you it's got to be a ray tracing capable world. Like, what's the point of adding it if you can't always turn it on? But I'm going to show you how you can turn it on on any world. So essentially, there's a resource pack that you need to download. And I'm going to have it linked in the description. And it's going to bring you to this web page. All right, here we are. So this is the web page for the resource pack you need to download called Kelly's Minecraft Vanilla RTX Conversion Pack. So it essentially just allows you to enable ray tracing on any world. Keep in mind, you do need a ray tracing capable graphics card, just an FYI. So yeah, it basically allows you to have all the effects of ray tracing on whatever world you want. All you need to do is have the resource pack enabled. So there's a few different add-ons that come with it. I'll show you in a second that change some things. If you want to read this, just click the link and read it for yourself. I'm not really going to go through it. But when you scroll down like I did, you'll see the download list. So basically you want to download the one on the top, but I recommend you download all of them. So just do that. It'll download, download really fast. And you want to put them in your resource pack folder. So that's actually a lie. All you need to do is download these files and run them. And they'll automatically install to where they need to go because they're a .mc pack file. So if you need any help with that, just leave a comment, but it'll automatically install for you. So once you have them downloaded, this is what you need to do. So when you're on the game, before you join the world or anything, you need to go to your settings and scroll down until you see global resources. And then you'll see under the my packs, it'll have all the packs that you downloaded. So basically you want to activate all of them. Activate, 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 get them all in there. Keep it coming. Now when you go to active, you'll see you have all these in the active section. I recommend having the RTX one on the top. So you can just click the up arrow, move it all the way to the top. I don't think it necessarily makes a difference, but just put it on the top. So now that you have that ready to go, your game might take a second to load everything. I mean, it's loading a lot at once, so just give it a little bit of time. All right, so once it's loaded and ready, this is what you'll see, Minecraft Kelly's RTX. So now you could just join any world. So let's go back to the realm and let's get in here. And as you can see, once you load in, Everything has ray tracing. It's pretty sweet. It's pretty crazy. Makes you wonder why he can't just turn the setting on normally, but then this resource pack enables everything for you. But you can see ray tracing, real time lighting. Pretty cool stuff. So this just makes Minecraft look unbelievable. Let's see, let's let's get rid of all these. And you'll see just how dark it is like you can't even see in the door but you put a torch down and now it's good crazy stuff i'm a huge fan of this ray tracing it's tough to play with it on all the time though especially if you go into a cave and try to mine like it's way darker than if you would to just play normally but here we are it's pretty cool so if you liked what you're seeing and this helped you out, consider liking the video and subscribe for more mods and, and tutorials and tips. 
It's pretty crazy ray tracing when you're playing with your friends. Unfortunately, no one's in the game. But yeah, this will work on any world. You have the pack installed and you'll have ray tracing on any world that you play on. So leave a like, consider subscribing. This has been X Chopper. Peace.